What the hell is that? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Hello. Hi, what you doing? Oh, just reading this uh, book, Hoopa Project, and looking up some Bigfoot sightings for my next videos. What's up? Cool. Well, I was just wanting to see if you would bring me some lunch today. All right. Where are you, where from? Uh, how about uh, Chip and Joe's? Mm -mm. Chip and Joe's. What do you want? Cheeseburger basket. Cheeseburger basket. All right. That sounds good. All right. Thank you. Be there in a little bit. All right. Bye. Bye. Duty calls. Let's go get some Tina some lunch. Chip and Joe's is so cool, so good. They're always packed. I mean, look at their little parking lot and it is just packed. But it's always good if you want some just home cooked food. Chip and Joe's in Salem, it is great. Now we gotta take Tina's cheeseburger basket from Chip and Joe's. Well, I got Tina some lunch, got myself some lunch at Chip and Joe's. Dropped her lunch off at work for her. And uh, now I'm gonna go back in here and uh, finish doing some research for my next uh, Bigfoot video. What is that? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Somebody sent me a box. We're gonna go check it out. See what's inside this box.
it says on here that uh, it is from Matthew Cox. So I would imagine that Matthew and Courtney have been up to something. And I want to open this right now to figure out what's inside. But I guess I better wait till uh, Tina gets home. Just to be fair. Dang it. Check it out sometime. As you know, I have been waiting all day to open this box to see what's inside. It is from one of our trailblazers, Matthew Cox and his wife, Courtney, and they sent us this box. I have no idea what's inside. Well, I sh I'm hoping it's, I can hear a little, hmm, I don't, no, I don't really hear I don't anything. Know. I don't know what it is. It's a pretty, uh, but we're going to find out right now. Packed up box here. So, I love packages. All right. Maybe there's something haunted in here because as soon as I started cutting the box open, my camera shut off. <laughs> Maybe it's just my camera. My camera's been shutting off in weird places. Uh, but anyway, uh, I got to this far <laughs> and we got some paper. And, oh, we got this. Ooh, oh, look, there's a card. All right, let's sit that down. Let's read the, hang on just a second. Okay, team's gonna open the card. You don't have to read it all out loud, but. Hope you enjoy this gift from us to you. You guys are the best from Matthew and Courtney. Keep it squatchy. Keep it squatchy. <laughs> That's right. That's awesome. <laughs> so we got this big old something something right here. Oh my goodness. Nice and taped up. Yeah. Lots of bubble wrap. It's so much fun opening up stuff. <laughs> and it's really wrapped up, let me tell you. They protected say. this thing. Yes, hmm. That's a familiar shape. Let's see what we have. Oh, it's, it's well, that's <laughs> part of it. They, <laughs> and... Oh my oh goodness. My goodness, guys. That is awesome. I was not expecting no, this. Not at all. God. Wild Turkey Kentucky Spirit. Oh. And I, they know that that's no my words. favorite whiskey, <laughs> and I did, and I have not been able to find no. the uh 2023 version so oh this God. was uh this bourbon whiskey was bar bottled on february the first 2023 nice so that is so cool Guys, kentucky spirits a single barrel you are the best you shouldn't have give us thank a you couple so glasses. much <laughs> We're good. I know you guys have uh, recently gotten this yourself. Okay, I'll get them. And, I'm sorry. <laughs> and, yeah, ever since uh, we saw that they got that, uh, this wild turkey Kentucky spirit. Mm -hmm. Courtney found it on a uh, business trip or something. Yeah. And she brought it home to Dice and Matthew. Yeah. And I was wanting to try this. So it's so exciting that we got it. Yes. And Dice 
is, of course, Di Sniper from Gambling Granny. That's her husband. <laughs> Courtney's their daughter. And let's see if we can... Oh, we're going to have to open this up again. <laughs> I know it has a little thing, but I like using my knife. I don't want to mess up the uh, the cork. The topper. Oh, I am so excited for this. Oh, and you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to compare because they are single barrels. They may be slightly different. Uh, I'm going to compare the, I can tell you right now, yeah, they're pretty much the same color. Pretty close. This one's just this one's a little darker. This one, yeah, this one might be a little darker. The the new one. So here's the cork pool for Kentucky Spirit. Guys, I I'm just so excited about yes. this. Thrilled. Oh, good cork pool. Nice pop. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's like, you know, that just the smell is like one of those caramel creams that you get, which I love those caramel with the little white cream in the middle. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. You smell before I pour it in my glass. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's got a sweet smell. Sweet, sweet. Yes. Nice little glug glug there. There you go. Mm, mm, mm. I could smell brown sugar on that one. Mm -hmm. The vanilla. A little ethanol came through because it's a 10. Is it 101 or 104? I believe it's 101. Yep, 101. Mm hmm. Mm. Yes. Oh, a little bit of, little tiny hint of oak. Yes, and some, a little bit of cherries. Got to oh, let's, let's go, swirl yeah, it let's around. get it opened up a little bit. Warm it up. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> let's check it out. Guys, that's just that's that that's just amazing. Good. It is just a little spicy on the front, and then it just keeps getting sweeter in the back with a little tiny bit of oakiness back mm -hmm. there. But I get the oaky. But no bitterness at all. And the warm, it's mm -hmm. not to me. It's not hot like some one hundred and one proofs are. It just. It's just a slow warm, mm -hmm. and it's working its way down. And mm -hmm. even the so oakiness good. is like covered in like sweetness. It's like yeah, just oh my goodness, it's sugary sad. deliciousness. Now I'm curious if it tastes very similar to the 2022. Since this is 2023, and you can see I've drunk the heck out of this. <laughs> yeah. It's disappearing, but we're going to try just to just to compare, see if it's changed. This one's been opened a lot longer. Mm -hmm. So this is 2022. Get the same nose, but now this is, this is like... Uh, the 2023 is just a little bit heavier on the nose. Mm -hmm. I get a little more oak on the 2023, which I like that oak. Yeah. Um, now, th this has been sitting out for a long time, the 2022. It has a little more, you say you got the oakiness on, it, oakiness on this, but I'm getting a little bit more bitterness now that it's almost done still a lot of sweetness on the 2022 mm -hmm. yeah this one's a more um they're very close but 
Wow. I, to me, I get more oak yeah. taste on the 2023. I get more oak. I get more. It's um, just f more flavors. I mean, we've, we've uh, since it's a new bottle, I don't know if you want it anymore, but. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is 2023. Oh, this just is. A little sweeter smelling. Pure deliciousness. I mean, this is so good, it's dangerous. You could sit here and just sip and, and this sip one and sip. Is a little spicier, hotter on the front mm -hmm. than this one is for me. Now, this one does give me a right. long, warm, slow, warm hug. And this one kind of hits me right up front. Yeah. Mm. This one has like the there's a little bit more ethanol in the 2022. Mm -hmm. I mean nothing overbearing at all. Right. It's still but, very And delicious. it's it's been open for a long time, but now the 2023 is man, that that's a really really nice whiskey. Still my favorite. I would score this just like I did the the last time. It's a 97. To me, it's the it's the, my That's favorite. Pretty high, yeah. Oh goodness! So, you want a barrel to hunt, a bottle to hunt, and a single barrel? Go get you some wild turkey Kentucky spirit. Be on the hunt for that. Yeah. Uh, that is. It is worth it to. <laughs> Worth the hunt. It really mm. is. Now we just need to find a Russell's Reserve single barrel store pick. Yeah. Those are the those are the best. Uh, they're t that's Tina's favorite. Yeah. And they're like might be second to me. I might be switching. So <laughs> to, the, the, to the 2023 Kentucky Spirit. So the one thing um, is uh, Matthew. And Courtney tried this and sent me a clip of them trying it, which I was like, oh, I'm so jealous. But it's a good little <laughs> clip, and I'm going to play that right now. And thank you, guys. Thank you so much, Matthew and Courtney. Yes, and thanks. You're the best. All our subscribers and our Trailblazers and Patreon members, and if you are interested you know the patreon really helps buy bottles and it really unless people gift them to you then that's the yep. best way to then do it you're and uh very lucky <laughs> uh so we appreciate you guys let me show you matthew and courtney's uh clip of them trying uh the kentucky spirit <laughs> and courtney yeah she's not a whiskey connoisseur but she tried it she gave it a great effort oh yeah totally yeah so, all right. Keep, Keep it, it squatchy. Cheers. Hey, Walt and Tina, Courtney and Matt. I wanted to send you a video because I got Matt, well, and Dice, but Matt something too. He wanted to show you and we wanted to taste it in front of you. So, show him what you got. John, the Bigfoot of bourbon, the golden egg. I got him the Kentucky Spirit. Wild Turkey Kentucky Spirit. I got that. We wanted to try this with you because this has been number one on my hunt. I'm the daughter of the year and the wife of the year. Shh, I gotta pop it. Okay, jeez. Oh, <laughs> okay. So we're gonna try, ooh, I can smell that. That was impressive. I can smell it. <clears throat> okay. So we're gonna try it. I'm not a real like whiskey person, so. Okay, that's enough, that's way enough. Okay, I can smell it from here. Here's our little glasses. It smells like heaven. That's way too much for me, so this ought to be interesting. Okay, we gotta sniff it. Oh, that smells. That smells real hard. 
<laughs> it smells real rough. You gotta get her activated. It smells like a broken ankle. This isn't Malort. That shit's like the devil. It. Smells like a broken ankle. Okay. So we're gonna do a little sniffing and sipping for ya. Okay. Is this good? Is this how we do it? Oh, that smells amazing. I can already tell I'm not gonna like this. Okay. Here we go. Cheers. Oh, that's amazing. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. It's very smooth. Mm hmm. Very smooth. Mmm. Yum. Does it taste better than jewelry? <laughs> yes, it does. It tastes better than jewelry. Definitely. Walt did say you can never trust the first sip, though. Okay, so let's go in for number two. Ready? Remember, slow, swish it around, I, I got, and then just let her slide down. I, I got it. Thank you. It's. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> yeah mm, I, I, I don't know how y'all can drink it straight because I definitely need to put it in something that's but amazing I'll always try it won't I it's good and neat but I'm gonna try to put some ice in it too well we wanted to share with you because I know this is a very big deal so here is the Kentucky Spirit Whiskey. Cheers. Cheers.